Perhaps the clearest sign that Amy Grant's injuries were more serious than we knew was her husband, Vince Gill, and their daughter Karina breaking down as they tried to sing When My Amy Prays at the Ryman Auditorium earlier this month. <laughs> Quote, I'm just like my dad, Karina said, alluding to the fact that Vince Gill has a good cry daily. During the same show, Vince actually gave fans good news by saying Amy was, quote, doing fine. But then he added that she had been knocked out for 10 to 15 minutes after a bicycle accident on July 27th in Nashville. She was wearing a helmet, but we now know she suffered a concussion. I still it's Addison Hager, and Amy's manager says she's, quote, getting stronger every day, just as she did after her heart surgery. We are amazed at how fast she heals. If you feel a butt coming, you're absolutely right. First, let Amy know you're thinking of her, and then tap subscribe to stay up to date on this. Fans of Amy, Vince, and great classic country artists know we're the place for that, and we really appreciate you if you're back for this video. To rewind, Amy was forthcoming after the accident. Her team said she hit a pothole and was hospitalized briefly. Due to doctor's orders, she had to postpone four concerts to 2023, but no other changes on her tour were made. Sadly, Amy just postponed 24 more tour dates to give her enough time to recover. That's two months worth of shows, giving her nearly four months off the road total, as her next show won't be until late November when her Christmas tour with Michael W. Smith begins. Quote, she wants to be able to give 100% when she tours, and unfortunately, we do not think that will be the case by the time rehearsals would start for the fall dates. The statement indicates that she's now alert and appreciative of the good wishes and prayers being sent her way. Quote, she feels the impact of the collective good will extend her way. Fans filled her social media feed with good vibes after her initial announcement, and even with the sad news, they'll surely do it again. If you drop a comment below, please keep Vince, Karina, and Amy's three kids with her first husband in mind, as they too are no doubt hurting. All of this came two years after Amy underwent surgery to correct a PAPVR condition in her heart. Subscribers know we covered that in depth with this video back in June of 2020. Grant was very forthcoming about that surgery, sharing photos and appearing on morning television to talk about it in hopes others may recognize signs of the birth defect. By February of 2021, she said she's feeling fantastic, and we're hopeful the same can be said soon. I'm Addison Haker for Taste of Country. Thanks for watching.